Grim hook. Looks like we're not off the hook. Yeah, I like the cursor. The cursor's a spooky hand drawing. Did I make it? Where's my ship? Did I make it? Where's my ship? That's what I just said. No. Oh no, my boat. What happened to you? Not in amber clad. Well, she sunk. Well, I'm sunk. This is kind of like dishonoredy. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not getting up that ledge with my hand. Yeah, you are. There's a yellow tarp, there might dude. Be something I can use around here. There's a yellow tarp. That means you can climb it. All right, fine. I'll use the grapple hook. But until then, oh, yeah. this is this is very dishonored -y so far, which, as you know, I approve of. All right, grapple climb. So he can climb when he's holding a grapple hook in his right hand, but not otherwise. What do I grapple to? No way. Is that the the seawall? The seawall. What happened while I was gone? The water's probably only gotten worse since I left. I gotta get into the city. Do I have a hook throw yet? Or just a jump? Just a jump. Okay, I have a jump and clamber. Jump and clamber. Where are the workers that used to scold us? A good combo. Why is everything so Whoa. Here we are in the Cavern of Doom. Oh man, I gotta do the granny rags and slackjaw side quest. Oh, there's the heart. Wow. That's just the heart from Dish Nord. Oh my god. Listen to me, Darnus. What? Darn at this. My name is Darnus. My game, my guy sucks. Sure. My guy is named say? after the Dardanelles. I like the hand animations. The hand animation is very expressive. I can feel the great age ending. Uh, this is very dishonored so far. I know I've said that a lot, but it's true. It's the honest truth, dadgummit. Whoa, are you doing this? Yes. My strength may be limited. But there's still so much She gave me a double jump. Honestly, double jump's a pretty cool ability to have in real life. Damn. Any idea? Watch out for the Debris. It'll room. kill you. Do I have a wall run? Just relax. Let my power course through you. Look at the ground and press space to launch yourself, alright? There will be no obstacle we can't overcome. Especially once we have the relic dagger. Crap. I hope that didn't do it. That was not what I was trying to do. Okay, when the crosshair is green, then tentacles activate. Gotcha. That's the rule. So you face away. Yeah, look at that. All right. This game is good. Grimhook is good. Launch off surfaces to maintain your momentum. Although the E and the C are way too close in that font. They got to get a different font. It sound easy. Crap. Hmm, mistake, mistakes. Wait, what did it say? What did the tutorial message say? Did I miss it? Did it say you can like bounce to maintain momentum? Yeah, that's what it said. Okay, good. Whoa, that was amazing. I retroactively read it. Yes, it's so freeing to soar through the air once again. Crap. I've forgotten how good it feels to have a vessel. Is that the term for this situation? Am I a vessel now? Uh, that just vesseled. Once we reach the city, I'm sure there will be a problem. That just vessied. Hmm. I'm lacking in momentum to cross this gap. I just lost my momentum. Oh, I can hop on the wall geometry. It's probably not intended. Hmm. Would you rather have double jump in real life or signposted ledges and be able to climb everywhere? Honestly, maybe climb everywhere. That sounds useful. I got really good speed that time. What the heck? Is it like a timing thing? I did skip the tutorial message, so there we go. I had to double jump that time. What do I use my hook? I want to use my grapple hook. I want to, like, grapple an enemy. Crap. All the way back.
Oh, it kind of sounds like a Modern Warfare 2 intervention. Uh, do you think you can help me? Of course. I'm not sure what you have in mind. Wall run, yes, of course. Gotta have that. Hey, uh, Kaya? How did you know my name earlier? Please, Dardanus. Because your name is Dardanus. What kind of a name is Dardanus? I forged this entire island from ash. How are you so unfamiliar with me? Dog Warden, thank you for subscribing. And I fell in the waterfall and died. I'm not sure. You distracted me. But I hope this ignorance is not shared by the rest Come on. Of the ah. Just gotta get enough speed. Nope. People have been laughing at his name all over the island, yeah. Yo, bro, do you see Dardidus today? <laughs> his name is really Dardidus, dude. What a lame name. Can I, like, get onto that ledge? No. Is this Gollum? No, it's not Gollum. It does have wall running like Gollum had. So which wall is it? I guess it's not that wall, but this wall leads to the waterfall. Maybe I don't jump off. Maybe I just go around the corner. Usually wall run gamer guy cannot go around a corner while wall running. Yeah, the waterfall just shoots you down into the ground. You can't go under the waterfall and expect good things to happen. Please? There we go. It was the issue of distance. They call me the Jedi falling over. They call me the Cal Kestis. They call me the Respawn's Cancelled Mandalorian video game. Why did they cancel that? Imagine canceling a Mandalorian video game. You gotta be insane. You gotta be out of your mind. Hmm. Not quite, but kinda. First try. Listen, Dart. You need to use everything I've taught you until now. All right. I can sense the relic just up ahead. I'll do it. I know you can do this. Think of how many Baby Yoda skins they could have sold. I know. They could have sold so many skins for his little pod thing that carries him. It could have been the hit game everyone's talking about. Everyone is talking about it, but not in a good way. She seems pretty nice for a skull lady. Yeah, she's not bad. For a lady shaped like a skull, you know, she's pretty friendly. She's no Sans, but who is? Welcome to the underground. Why did I jump? I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, we're going to that wall right there. There we go. It really, the more I hear the jumping sound effect, it really does sound like the Modern Warfare 2 intervention to me. I've listened to that isolated sound effect many times, because whenever I need a gunshot for a video, I use that sound because it's funny to me. Nowhere to go but down. I have a ground pound now. There it is. The relic dagger. I knew I sensed it. Yeah, give me a sword. You mean this old thing? I can see the relic in it, but the dagger part looks like it's about to snow. Uh-oh, he broke it. So it has. How frustrating. Forging a new relic takes years. And here I thought I was Yeah, forging a relic does take a while considering relic means extremely old. Please, Dart. It probably doesn't even become a relic to at least 100 years after it's forged. My power. It's returning. I think it looks pretty good. So I taped her to the grapple hook. Oh, now I can use a grappling hook. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, big time. Look at that mana bar, dude. That mana bar is Whoa, so dishonored. Hey, We're under the seawall. Dude, Arcane Studios, I love you, but screw Arcane Studios. They forgot how to make good games. Whoever made this grapple hook game, they can make Dishonored too. 
The seawall kept the corrosive water at bay. Corrosive water? My island. What has become of it? What's becoming your island? Probably nothing good. Well, when you're on a holiday. Disgust me to be near it. This is fun. Stench. Unfortunately, on the Steam page for this, all the reviews said it was like one minute long, and I said, please make this a full game. So I have a feeling it's gonna end right when I really want to play ten hours of it. So that'll suck. Press spacebar to leap off when grappling. Ooh, nice. Crap, what happened there? I don't want to land back down. Oh, man. When do you press space during this sequence? It's just kind of auto jump off it. Maybe some, maybe the, one of the dangling guys looks different. No, not really. Hmm. Get me over there. Get me over fastball. Okay, yeah, if you hit space, you do get a little bit more of a jump. Instead of just being propelled forward. Yeah, corrosion. So is it like space right when you're on the lantern, maybe? Like right when you contact it? Yeah, that's what it is. Still not enough speed, though. Hmm. There we go. Double jump. I think I found the source. It does. I can't really tell when I have the double jump charge or not. Just gotta like remember if you use it. Maybe the glowing green has something to do with it. Hit enemies with the whip and then grapple them to kill them. All right, sounds good. Of course. Nothing would make me happier than He's just a crappy little guy. Golems of idolatry. Golems of idolatry. Uh oh. Die, golem. These golems ain't sturdy at all. They got no sturdiness. No sturdy golems. Is that a shooting golem? It is. It's not Gollum, but it is Golem. If they make this into a full game, they gotta make the enemy design better. Are you sure you don't have vessel training? They're good to grapple, though. They're fine. They're fine for this. Combine your abilities and then use control to stun them. That guy means business. Because they're really easy to see. They're really easy to grapple, which is good. Very readable enemies. Just, I'd rather fight like a guy instead of like a like a literally a piece of geometry with a gun on it. I want to fight the Dwemer Sphere, not that Dwemer loose metal scraps. I just like stay airborne when killing them. I'm taking damage, taking fire. Blast them. Blast them. It's one of Caffeine Man's wall cans. Hey everybody, Caffeine Man here. I've been possessed by the guys of death, and I have new jumping powers coming right up. It's a healthy guy. It has to be a three hit combo. It can't be three hits over time. Noted. Maybe you'll come across a Dwemer Centurion. There might be a boss. Might be a boss mob. Well done, Dart. Dart? My name is Dart me. now? What? Don't call me Dart. I call me Dardanelle. Call me my full name. Dart. Duly noted. I write it down in my notebook. There we go.
When was this released again? I'm not sure. <laughs> you never fail to impress Kyle. I didn't look at that part. It feels like I've known how to harness your abilities my whole life. It does seem to come natural to you. Like when you ran on the walls earlier. I've never seen anything like it. You haven't played enough video games then. Hey oh. Well, that? I learned tricks like that on the ridges of Isai. Mmm, the ridges of Isai. A boost, though. I learned tricks like that with Ridge Wallet. Download now for a free Ridge Wallet. Oh, I have a midair dash. How long have I had a midair dash? Probably, <laughs> probably for like the entire game. I'm just now discovering it. Whoops, that would have been helpful to have when I was missing platforms by five feet multiple times. Oh, you just got it? Okay, good. Makes me feel a little bit better. Press shift to swiftly move off objects. Yes, indeed. Uh, wall. Hang on, hang on, I can save it. So I'm assuming there is some difference between shift and just jumping off of a thing. Yeah, shift gives you more of a forward boost. Jump just gives you a jump. Give him one of these. Give him a jump, give him that. One of those. There you go. And now I just gotta ride this to the top, right? Ride up the old red crystals. All right, I made it. I made it to the carriage cart, let's go. Guess I'll keep heading upstream? I forgot which way I came from. Never a good thing to do. Please? Okay, good. We're getting pretty close to the Here we are in Willy Wonka's Wonderland. You think my mom and pop are okay? Nah, they're probably dead. I cannot guarantee anything dark. They probably got Uncle Owen and Brood. They got turned into skeletons by the Empire. What the? Oh, it's off. Oh, no, they turned it off on me. It's fine, though. Yeah. Hit Q to subdue. All right. Whoa. Did you just do If you say so. Call it a team effort. Get him, Dardanelle. Now it's playing that Borderlands combat loop. Now it's playing Southern Shelf. They got the Borderlands music on the Dishonored graphics. Are they trying to be my most beloved? They got Dwarven Metal Scrap. Think of the Dwarven bows I can make. People are always like, you make iron daggers in Skyrim, level up, ha ha ha. Those people are fools. Dwarven bows is where it's at. Real Skyrim gamers know the truth. If only this guy had some student debt. That's what Arcane Studios has been adding to their games lately. They have the telekinetic threat and student debt, that'd be good. Be gone. Be gone, evil cookware. Enemy crock pot spotted. I got a visual on an enemy air fryer over. This is like Disney G Force. I gotta fight the evil toasters. And my name starts with the syllable Dar. Wow. The similarities run deep. Give him a tentacle. Give him data tentacle remastered. Oh, he moved. Yeah, this could get more complex if a lot of guys spawn. If I'm really bullet helling it up. Right now, there's a small, manageable number of guys. Is that a med kit or a mana kit? Probably a mana kit. Do you have mooch ability? I don't think so. I don't think I can deploy mooch. Thought gold rings were the meta? Uh, you need mods for that, right? I'm pretty sure gold rings is immersive armors. I'll have to use more of my power to- Cause you can craft gold rings out of gold coins, but you have to have immersive armors, I'm pretty sure for that. I don't think that's vanilla. Maybe it's vanilla. Cause you can craft gold rings with a gold ingot. 
Oh no, gold earrings is immersive armor. Yeah, with gold ingot and a jewel. If you have a jewel, we can craft a ring. We have to have jewels though. You have to have jewels and ingot. Because immersive armor is adds the earrings you can make with just 100 gold. Those are really strong. Hello, writhing tentacle. I'm writhing, I'm writhing. You can do it without a jewel, it gives you two. Is that in vanilla Skyrim? I could have sworn that was not in vanilla. Yep. Hmm. Was it added with a creation club this thing? Is incredible. Were you able to do this the whole time? Is that new? Yes, but the strength it requires is immense. I never knew. Your impromptu relic isn't enough to do this off. You probably still get more XP from a weapon, like though. I would guess. Can't fix. Wait, do you do you craft the ring with money or with golden bar? Because if it's with golden bar, it sucks. Because you gotta obtain golden bar. If you, with ingot, yeah, it sucks. Then that's not good. If you have gold ingots, you use them to make jewelry. But like you can't just spam jewelry because the resources are annoying to gather. Because with immersive armors, you can uh, smelt golden coins and earrings, which is like way too strong and should probably not be in the mod. It like nullifies the entire crafting loop. What am I playing a game for if not the crafting loop? You're a Skyrim nerd, please. That's like super surface level. That isn't an impressive amount of lore knowledge. That's not even lore. It's just like gameplay of Skyrim. You can use transmute spell. Oh yeah, I love waiting one hour over and over and over again. Transmute mineral ore is so boring. It's fun on your first playthrough and you're like, wait, what? I can break the whole game, huh? But then it's like, am I just gonna, am I really gonna use this again? It's a waste of my time. Again, what am I playing a game for if not for the crafting loop? I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Hang on. I'm janking up the geometry Skyrim style. Nope. I gotta play the game the real way. There's a gold mine next to Markarth. Uh, I think Markarth is a blood and silver mine, actually. Blood and silver, friend. Blood and silver. Oh, this is the ancient volcano chamber. This is where we'll meet our toughest foe, no doubt. King Dodongo himself. Oh, don't fall in the pit. The pit of goo waits for you. Do not descend or meet your end. Die, robot. Okay, looks like a med kit, I think. Come lam. You see, now there's like 50 guys. The bullet hell nature becomes more obvious. Because when you're fighting like two guys at a time, like this is it, this is the combat. When there's several of them, it's like, ah, okay. It's a little interesting. You can knock him into the lava to kill him. Okay, we got knockdown damage. They can just fall and die. Yeah, the spin move. The Red Hat Society has a spin move. I repeat, the Red Hat Society has a spin move. Oh man, they're killing me. I'm getting slaughtered. Where's the medkit at, Red Hat? So they need two, I think. They need two combo chains to be dead. Look at that move. Look at that move set. He died from one. A med kit, please. I'm in big trouble. How we doing? 
Oh, my health is back. Nice. Maybe the ground pound restored it. Something restored it. Something gave me some free health care. That was really bad. That was sloppy. That could have looked cool if I nailed it, but I did not nail it. All right, is there going to be a boss robot? Is up. This is going to take a lot out of me. Come on, you're like the goddess of the skull and you can't jump. You can't do a super jump. Oh, she's spawning tentacles. Okay, that's going to take a lot out of her. It's spawning in the necessary grapple points. I mean, I feel like a deity. This, this should be no sweat for a deity, right? It's not that much. Keep on grappling. Oh, look at that dystopian wasteland. Look at that hell hole. I'd love to explore that hell hole in a full game. Somebody blew up Dunwall and put a bunch of cranes everywhere. Who put a bunch of cranes on my Dunwall? Developed by Unlimited Fries. Good name for a developer as well. This is the closest I've seen to somebody like just replicating the Dishonored aesthetic. So just for that reason alone, please make this a full game. The game is pretty fun too. A plus.